Hey everybody, welcome back. Uh, when we last left off, we got this. Which is pretty nice. We had killed this plant monster. Did we go up here? This is where we ran into a dead end, right? Yes, we had one of those drill bots being lazy there. So that's our problem to solve. We can get through here, and that doesn't actually help us because... That drill bot needs to be turned on. So we're actually going to the generator room. Which is way down here. But it is not connected to this. This is actually just uh, right below the... What health upgrade was that? Well, that's, this is right below the start. That's the sand area. Alright, we couldn't get this, right? This is where the, uh, the one with the tube going up was. We couldn't get yeah. through there. So we actually need to get this health upgrade at some point, too. I still don't think we can. But to get here, we're going to have to go probably through here. I think. I think you're right, yeah. So we're going to teleport to this room. Let's go do that. This thing charges midair. It's not like the jump. We can do it uh, all over the place. So what you're saying is, it's fucking great. It is amazing. There's no limit to the number of times we can do this in a leap, as long as the cooldown goes. We also have uh, a lot of uh, invulnerability movement through, like we can teleport through enemies. Apparently kills them, I forgot about that. Oh yeah. <laughs> wow, that's neat. Hey. <laughs> oh, not like that. Get over here, you. I'm testing this out on this crawl bot. How did we do that to that sucker? I don't think it's working on these. What about that below sucker? I'm not allowed to do it in the water. All right. One limitation. Hey, fly. Yeah, okay, so... Yeah, there we go. If they're flying, apparently we can injure them with it, which makes it even more appealing. Uh, let's go down, though. I think the contact frames on those little crawly ones are just a bit difficult to hit with the with the dash. Yep, I think they're too small. Well, I just took a, a lot of damage for fun, so maybe we should go heal real quick. <laughs> This is probably my favorite power next to the hookshot because, wow, it's travel speed. It's It's got this great sound effect. I love everything about it. I am inclined to agree, yeah. And then there's this. We can get through here. So this is actually maybe the place to go. Oh, no, that's we, we've been there before. We can just go there without having to deal with a mess of uh, walking around. Hey, fly. Yeah. Ain't so hot now, are you, fly? There's this. We have not gone down here. And that could be something cool. Let's go down there. Yeah. We have... Oh. Oh, my. This thing can be killed now with charge shot. I don't know if we ever killed the other one. No, we didn't. We left him alone. They're, they're tough little jellies. Yep. Okay, we had to kill that one to open this. And what we got is a data disk. I never talked about what these did. I kind of trailed off and started talking about how the map is a map. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we will find out exactly what they do soon, I think. We'll see. In the meantime, I'm just going to keep collecting them all as I see them. We have, like, fake walls in this maze, and there are crawl bots, sparky things to hurt us. Ow. Where's the entrance? Give me that thing. Oh, God. How do you get there? I don't remember this. I think I have to go in from the bottom. Oh man. Oh no. <laughs> yeah, you do. Yeah, okay. There we go. It obviously holds some kind of information, but uh, we can't look at it right now. Well, you're almost dead. That's true. We need to get out of here in one piece, and I forget the way out. You went up and around. I somehow missed it the first time through and that really hurt. <laughs> Hopefully that energy, yeah, okay. It doesn't get them left. Let's get out of here. Okay, so. Just checking around, but this is gonna be our exit. Oh.
where did we end up? All right. Yeah, this was the thing that looked weird before, and maybe this is why there's a heel down here. Ah! <laughs> the sneaky worm. Okay, so we're pretty much back where we uh, were before we fell down there, so that was all for a data disc. Now we can head to the destination over here. I'm not even using this as much as it, it it's actually faster charged than I thought it was. I can really fly. <laughs> okay, this does one damage. One normal shot worth the damage. But it's a lot cooler. I don't think we ever came up here. I do not remember looking at this. Uh, so we shoot that and... I don't know why. We, did we not have hook shot? Because that's all we needed for this. Nah, we just never tried coming here. Uh, we can go left or down, I think. Yes, we can go down. Let's go left first. Let's go right first. <laughs> Hold on a second. I'm gonna go down here and take a look around. I think I remember uh, where a, this goes. There's a teleporter down here anyway, so... George Melons. <laughs> Hello, George. Somebody, somebody told me what this meant was some kind of character on some kind of sci-fi thing, and I don't remember exactly what the reference is. I'm pretty sure that it is some kind of reference, though, and not, like, a creator of the game. We'll have to check on that, I'm not sure. I would remember the name George Mellons if it was one of the devs. There's a save below us. There is... This actually looks like the correct path. Uh, I want to hit that save first before we mess around here. Oh, I actually remember what's, uh, what's on the upper left. It's the room for the diskettes, actually. Oh yeah? Well, we can check that out too. Here's our save. Oh, good. Ah. <laughs> yeah. Fun pipes. <laughs> well, what we have here is gold blocks that we cannot get rid of yet. If we destroy a certain robot, security will be overrode. All right, well. We'll check out the data diskettes in a bit. I think that the power might need to be on too for that to work, I'm not sure. But Maybe. you know, just, just in case that's true, we'll just go there later. So we could have come here earlier, but we would have run into a problem. Uh, we would not be able to get past that electricity right there. Without Well, you might be able to damage boost through it, but I kind of doubt it. You cannot. So we can dash through that. I'm just checking out the room real quick. I don't think you could even reach the electricity since you need the dash boost to get rid of the red blocks. That's true. So... Just another similar type of uh, obstacle. What is over here? Is this going to keep on going? Yeah, it is. We'll check this out later too. I'm thinking that goes towards the uh, the health upgrade that we did not get yet. Yeah, that way it goes towards the giant sandworm that we can't do anything about. Oh my god. Yeah. Main generator active, finally. All right. Beautiful. This uh, has finally been done, and it's actually a bad thing, because there's a lot of shit that's not 
been turned on? That's turned on now, and here's the first of those. Ah. This game, we talked about it a little bit, but it does a really good job of making old areas freshly dangerous, and what we just did is going to have tremendous effects on what the game plays like for the rest of the area that we've already seen. Okay, so these all have different powers. One of them explodes, one of them causes acid rain, which is honestly the worst one, I think. The gunner's pretty annoying. I think I might take him out first. Ow. I think red is my least threatening. Like, he just messed up his own attack there. <laughs> what are you doing, red? Ugh. Yellow and green are pretty dangerous. God. Yellow is defeated. Like, this is a boss where the triple shot would be super useful. Yep, this would have been cleaned up already if we had that. Ah, he got me. That's what I get for insulting red. Glorious red. <laughs> One more. One more shot, I think. Nice job, red. Come here. <laughs> Alright. Photo finish. That was not handled very well, but we got him. More importantly, we need to get to that save, and we need to do it um, despite the new threats. Things like security systems are on now that weren't on before. There's one. This laser is new. Anytime we go to a new area, we're going to have to check out what new things have appeared to screw up our, our little robot here. And yet another case of pretty obvious Metroid references, the little, uh... What do you what do you call them? Cheerios? If they shoot at you? <laughs> well, it did not turn on this, so gold blocks apparently have nothing to do with power. We need something else. I'm not sure what. Yeah. Yeah, just this little one tiny third is a pretty nasty addition to this room. Let's check out the data disk room because I think on that that might be a dead end. Uh, and then we can check out the room to the left. Might as well go that way. With the power on, our destination for actual progress is up top where, uh, where those robots were. Hey! There's so much, so much stuff to check out. Ah! Proper equipment. <laughs> <laughs> Sentient earthquakes. Damn you, nature. Here it is. So, diskettes, at last we see what they do uh, here on episode 4. Uh, they are just artwork and things like that. So here's the two we found, here's the depths. And we also have uh, Volcanic Sector. There is some other important data on one of these, one or two of these, but for the most part, uh, most of them are just artwork. We will collect them all and check them all out. but. Uh, None of them are really essential to the main game. It's pretty spiffy artwork, though. That's right. Getting them is challenging as heck. Like, the most difficult things in the game will involve grabbing some diskettes that are just ludicrous jumps. The two we found are probably the easiest ones to find. One of them involved an optional little jelly boss fight, and then we had to go through that maze. The other one was just hidden up in the, the ceiling of some room. Uh, I said I would go through that room down below, uh, since it connects anyway. Whoops. Excuse me, fly. You could also maybe at this point check out a room that's above the room with the golden blocks below. So there's something there.
Where's that at? Here? Yep. How do we get there? Go up from the teleport room. Did I just, did I just find the way? Hold on a second. Uh, what is this? That's the way out. You gotta go below and right. Alright. I think you should be able to access it by now. Ah. Yeah, we can get in there. Would have been a while before I saw that. Hey, I remember this. This room is, uh, if we want to talk to that fisherman, this is like a uh, you caught a glitch kind of room. Like if you're in a place where you shouldn't be, they send you here, right? Yep. Like if you mess around with the game's files um, and it doesn't work, it sends you here. We'll do that at some point and talk to that fisherman. <laughs> uh, that's what this room is for, though. Four pillars, four lock gates. Mm, yeah, there you go. <laughs> You can get out from up there, but you cannot get in. This was very puzzling to me for a long time, because I had no idea how you're supposed to talk to that fisherman. He seems so talkative. He's the only living thing we've seen. out, oh, aside from horrible monsters. Damn, I keep getting mixed up where I'm going. I'm going <laughs> left, down, and left. Come on. Get out of here. Let's go. Finally. Ah. I almost want to go down and heal. Man, I'll never make it out of here. <laughs> For all the health we have, we sure are getting our ass kicked. We're too reckless. Oh no. Oh no, one of these boys. These things that have been, uh, we've been looking at them all game, he is finally awake. The Black Knight bot is here. He's awake and dangerous as hell. What a cluster. Ah, oh, god. Get him. Oh, oh. god, oh god. Oh jeez. <laughs> He's been conquered. Where's the save room? Help. Okay, so we got a bumblefly and one of these fuckers. Oh, jeez. This could uh, be bad. I gotta kill that fly without getting hit. He will turn into two more flies. There we go. Then that one. Whoa! Hey, hey! You flew through the train. Hey, buddy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> That was a fine leap, but this room... Uh, the funny thing about this is, since we walked in here, assuming we get to a save point without dying, we have unlocked the teleport, and we can teleport up where that jerk is. There's no way up there from here, though, I don't think. Nope. I'm gonna kill him out of spite, though. <laughs> Jeez, Good. get... Get out of here! I... I... Oh, man. They are really strong. Turn on the power is dangerous, heck. <laughs> okay. Well then, we got, um, we are actually where we have been before. I don't think we can get to this, though. Can nope. we make it to that save point in one piece? It's gonna be tough, but... Or we can run to the right and try and get back in our other save room. Well, we gotta get past the bumblefly again. And the jumping boy. To, Where's this go? It's a dangerous route either way. I think this is the safer route. This does not get us the health pack at all. We're yeah, we need to be up top into that tube. So somewhere way up top is where we're looking for to get that. So that's out of reach, sadly. That is a full heal, right? I'm not even sure about that, but it would be nice. Maybe. Oh god, they're gonna shoot at me. <laughs> Shit. This oh. oh yeah. Can we even go up there? 
I don't know. I don't think we can. Shit. It's desperate times for this little robot. We're going swimming. This was a much more dangerous trip than I thought. All right, well, I do not want to fall in down below, so... Oh, no! No, 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 no! Oh, jeez! <laughs> Holy shit. Okay. Don't fly at me. Oh. We need to get back up top right here. Oh, this sucks. God, I'm tense as hell and I'm not the one playing. Jeez. Ah! Whoa! <laughs> I forgot that guy was even there. If we destroy these, we can get the jump we're looking for. Okay, there's the bumblefly. Oh, no! Oh, no, oh, no, 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 no. Is he, did he spawn any dudes? No, okay. That's those enemies out oh. of the way. No, no. How did I do this the first time? I hope I didn't screw it up by a del I'm just gonna get rid of this and then we can probably swing up there. It's probably easier than trying to jump. We have a hook shot, after all. Yeah, there. Just use all the tools at my disposal here. Now we need wow. to run through this room. This is gonna be tricky. Uh. Oh, man. <laughs> Here we go. You can do it. Mr. Knight, leave me alone. No! No! Oh! <laughs> I shouldn't oh. have jumped. I thought I could make it. Uh -uh. Ah, damn. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, get that teleporter room off screen and then uh, we'll resume from there next time. Damn it. <laughs>